Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is a quick demonstration of how to remove blank lines from a text file. We have a couple of options. We're going to use said, and said uh, is a great bash utility, really one to master if you have the time. Uh, this first one is going to remove the blank lines from the old text and then write the output to new text. Let's take a look at that. I'll use the Atom editor and let me bump up the font on that so you can see it. Let's make it uh, 28. Let's see if that works. Oh, that's too big. How about 20? Mm. Yeah, let's go to 18. Sorry. 18. All right, that's as close as going to get. And clear. Okay, so we have a couple files here. We have new text, old text. So let's do the old text first. And just so we are clear on what it looks like, uh, first I'll RM the new text, so it's not to confuse anything, LS, okay, we're clear. And now let's cat, <clears throat> let's cat the old text so you see what it looks like. Uh, you see that there's lots of blank lines in there. I don't want those blank lines, it's bad. So clear, and now I can just copy and paste this. Copy, Control Shift V to paste into the terminal, and it should work. Ah, right, because it's not there is no old text; it's old dot text. And <clears throat> run it again. Now, when we ls, we have new text and old text. So let's cat the new text, new. And you'll see that all of the blank lines have been removed. All right? Now, we can also do the same in the existing text by using the, by using the switch I, which means in the file. And let's fix that. Control C. And then Control Shift V to paste into the terminal. And when I run it, see not, nothing came out necessarily. But when we cat the old text, we'll see that it now has removed all of the lines. And it has. All of the blank lines, rather. Okay, thanks for watching. And again, the commands are said apostrophe forward slash caret dollar forward slash d apostrophe and then the name of your file and then you can pipe it out to a standard out to whatever file you like thanks for watching happy computing